Well, you know, from Hollywood stars to athletes, IV hydration therapy is all the rage on the East and West Coast. And yes, it's now right here in the Mid-South. Yes, it is. People go into spas or clinics, have a seat, and have an IV needle injected. Inside the IV bags are various combinations of vitamins or drugs, infusions offered for everything from making your skin glow to curing your hangover. Hmm. <laughs> so, who is doing it? And is it safe? Local 24 I team senior investigator Jenny DeFrizio is digging into this one. IV vitamin therapy isn't cheap. It can run from 75 bucks to a couple hundred dollars per treatment, depending on where you go and what you get. So does it work or is it a waste of your money? Well, that depends on who you ask. From Kim Kardashian to Mark Wahlberg, Hollywood tabloids and social media are filled with those in the public eye getting IV hydration therapy. Closer to home, Memphis lawyer Ed Wallace gets them regularly. Sometimes it gets that um, vibe of being maybe junk science when you read some things online, but from my personal experience, it works for me. We caught up with Wallace at Pro Health Wellness Clinic in East Memphis. If I get a sinus infection or if for some reason, you know, you have a you know, stomach bug or anything like that, the IV therapy, it just rehydrates your whole body. There is a long list of types of IV vitamin therapy, treatments to boost your immunity for hangovers, migraines, anti-aging, vitamin blasts. You can even have your own custom therapies mixed up. We have a lot of patients who are currently getting chemotherapy. They come in for high doses of vitamin C IVs. Clinic owner Estes Folk says this isn't just for people with medical conditions. IV hydration therapy also attracts the work hard, play hard crowd and those into physical training and wellness. The same person who is uh, probably going to yoga class or Pilates and getting massaged, they want IVs. While some swear by IV hydration therapy, others are skeptical. St. Francis Hospital registered dietitian Hannah Ostendorf says drinking plenty of fluids and eating right often works just as well as getting these expensive IV bags. She says for the majority of people who are getting the basic types of IV hydration, it won't hurt you because most of the vitamins are water soluble. In excess in your body, you're just going to pee what you don't need out. But there are exceptions, which is why Ostendorf says if you have medical conditions, check with your doctor. This is just actually a medical procedure that we've taken out of the hospital, stuck it in a clinic, and made it available to everybody. The Federal Trade Commission says it's illegal for IV therapy clinics to falsely advertise that they can cure serious diseases like cancer, multiple sclerosis, or congestive heart failure. If they're claiming that they're treating things, I would stay away. The East Memphis Center that Wallace goes to does not make those types of claims. Wallace says he's a true believer in the treatments. It makes me feel healthier. It makes me function better. It puts me in a good mood. So would you try this IV therapy? Go to our Facebook page and take the poll. Tell us why or why not. For the Local Eye Team, I'm Jenny DiPrizio.